1. An old photograph of the bustling street of Escolta in Binondo, Manila. Taken on 4 July, 1898. Manila and portions of the Philippine Islands was at that time occupied by the American forces after defeating the Spanish squadron in Manila Bay on May 1, 1898, during the Spanish-American War. 2. An old photo of Binondo, a district in Manila, circa early 1900s. Under the backdrop of the Binondo church are horse and carabao-drawn carriages. 3. Filipino insurgents are lined up as prisoners of war, POW, by Americans in this rare 1899 photo near San Miguel Cathedral in Manila. 4. Gate to Intamuros, Manila, late 1800s showing carabao-drawn carts going in and out of the walled city of Intramuros. 5. An elaborately designed gate in Fort Santiago, Manila, guarded by Spanish soldiers, circa late 1800s. Note the hexagram, symbol of the Star of David atop the arch. 6. Filipino insurgents captures a muzzle-loading cannon from Spanish forces and brought to their trenches near Fort San Antonio de Bat in Malata, Manila in 1898 just before American forces occupied Manila. 7. Spanish Captain General Basilio Augustin became governor of the Philippines on April 11, 1898. Less than two weeks into his term as governor, Spain declared war on the United States on April 23, 1898. Spain lost the Spanish-American War which ended in signing of the Treaty of Paris on December 10, 1898. Photo published by Pearson Publications Company in 1898. 8. Montage of old photos of Malacanang Palace, also spelled, Malacanan, circa late 1800s to early 1900s. The mansion was the Spanish Governor General's residence during the Spanish times. The buildings on the compound have undergone many renovations and extensions. Malacanang Palace has been the official residence of the President of the Republic of the Philippines since 1937. The first president to reside was Manuel L. Quezon. 9. An 1898 photograph of American soldiers guarding the bridge over Pasig River to Escolta, Manila. Photo was taken on the day Spanish forces surrendered to the Americans. Published by Harper and Brothers in 1899. 10. A photo of a street vendor in Manila selling vegetables, circa 1899. 11. An 1899 photo of Luneta Park in Manila. It was the promenade of choice during the Spanish era. The governor general with his entourage, the elite and the masses, would come in the afternoons and early evening to get some fresh air and watch the Spanish military band play. Luneta was also the place where special events were held, including celebrations, parades and executions. 12. Part of the Bridge of Spain aka Puente Espana spanning Pasig River in Manila, built by the Spaniards in 1632. The span has since been replaced by Jones Bridge, from Lawton going to Binondo. Above photo was taken in 1899. 13. Binondo Church and Convent, Manila in the late 1890s. 14. Old photograph, circle late 1800s, of a woman being helped by her children, iron clothes. 15. Photo of the execution of the Philippines' national hero, Dr. Jose Rezal, full name. Jose Protasio Rezal Mercado y Yolanzo Riolanda, on December 30, 1896 at Bagumbayan, later called Lineta, then again renamed Rezal Park in his honor. 16. An undated photo of Leonor Rivera, Jose Rezal's betrothed. Rivera was immortalized by Rezal as Maria Clara in his novel, Noli Mi Tangere. 17. An undated picture of Sampaloc, Manila, probably late 1800s. 18. Churchgoers, pedestrians and hawkers in front of the Quiapo Church in Manila. Circa 1900s. 19. A vintage photo of a cigar factory in Manila with mostly women workers. Circa. 1899. 20. The Scolta Street in Manila circa 1884. During this time, late Spanish era, Escolta was mostly a residential area. Right center is the belfry of Santa Cruz Church. 21. An unnamed canal in the city of Manila, circa 1899. Original photograph published by Harper and Brothers in 1899. 22. Old colonial buildings are protected inside the walled city of Intramuros, shown in the center left is the gate of Santa Lucia, late 1800s. 
23. Pasig River in Manila, circa 1899. The building on the left is a cigar and cigarette factory, further up is a sugar refining house, and at distant upper center of the picture is the dome of the oldest church in Manila, the Church of San Francisco. 24. Manila's old waterfront was busy with commerce. Photo shows Manila's port in 1899. 25. An old photograph, circa early 1900s showing a portrait of a young couple in formal attire. White coat and pants for men were introduced by the Americans after their arrival in the Philippines in 1898. 26. An 1898 photo of Spanish soldiers eating lunch while held prisoners by the Americans in Manila. 27. General Elwell Otis, left, with his staff at Malacanang Palace, circa 1898. Otis was the second American military governor general of the Philippines until 1900. The general was replaced by Arthur MacArthur, the father of General Douglas MacArthur. 28. A rare photo of General William Howard Taft riding a Carabaoer water buffalo. General Taft was the first American civilian governor general of the Philippines from July 4, 1901, to December 23, 1903. Taft Avenue in Manila was named in his honor. Above photo was taken in 1914. 29. An early 1900s photo of Lynetta, now Riesel Park, after the American arrived in Manila. The U.S. stars and stripes can be seen on the upper left of the photo and a large gazebo at the center of the park. 30. An old photo of a tranvia or tramvia, electric street tram, that used to ply the streets of Manila. The tranvia service started in 1905 during the American era. It was operated by the Manila Electric Railroad and Light Company, the same Moralco we know today. The Tranvia operated until just before World War II broke. <laughs>